Ladies and gentlemen, I have a 4.95 rating as an Uber driver. If you're joining in Tijuana, um, I'm going to show you why you should be using two phones. With two phones, you will truly maximize your earnings. I'm going to show you how to get the highest amount of tips per week, the highest earnings, and the highest ratings. Um, I've been told by the company that I'm one of the top rated drivers in Los Angeles. The top rated drivers here are 4.88 average. I come in at 4.95. There is something that I do every single, on every single trip to get me the highest amount of stars. And by offering this consistent professional service, I also get great tips. So the other day I did, th um, the day before yesterday, I did three short trips in the evening, which was $56. And then I got another $36 on tips. That was $92. So all of this is possible. <laughs> Excuse me. Um, if you deliver a top service, um, it's just like in a restaurant. If you get, you know, if you if you've got good food and then you have a waiter that gives you amazing service, you're going to get a great tip. That's the bottom line. Um, please go to the link um, in my video underneath the uh, the video. There's a description box. Fill that out by uh, by filling that out. I'm referring you, and then I get a, a referral tip which is a commission that can any can be anywhere between $100 and $500. And then I'm going to show you um, how you can go out and recruit other drivers. Everything you need to know to get the maximum amount of stars, how to choose the right music, when to engage with a customer, when not, what to have on board, what type of waters, what type of candies, what your car should look like on the inside, what it should look like on the outside, how to operate two apps to maximize your profits. All of these and many, many other things, airport pickups, hotel pickups, dealing with uh, problem crowds, dealing with, you know, any type of uh, person that gets in your car. I can definitely tell you after 2000 trips, I figured it out. So, I can help you make your first trip filled with fear and not filled, oh, sorry, <laughs> I can make you fill your, have your first trip filled with fun and not fear. I switched it around. I apologize. I want your first trip to be filled with fun and not fear. And yes, it, it was rather fearful in the first few months, but I want to cut through all of that and show you uh, what you can do so that you don't have that anxiety in the first few months. And so when you pick up your very first passenger from pick up to drop off that it becomes a great trip um, filled with enthusiasm and fun and professionality. Okay, reach out to me. You have my name, you have my number, you have my email. Bye-bye.